Hello everyone. So today we will discuss about the estimation of age by radiological examination part 2 that is 6 to 12 years. Myself, I am Dr. Neeraj Maheshwari. Now, for age estimation from 6 to 12 years, the x-rays which are considered are the elbow joint and the wrist joint. So, this is the humerus bone. You can see this is an elbow joint. This is the ulna, this is radius, this is the medial epicondyle and this is the lateral epicondyle and this is the radial head. So you have to focus on these points only. Okay. Now, this is an x-ray of wrist joint. You can see the various carpal bones. Okay. Now, you know, this is the capitate, hamate, pisiform, triquetrum, lunate, scaphoid, trapezium and trapezoid. Appearance of ossification center in carpal bones. We have learned that in previous lecture also, uh, but we have to revise here also. So, capitate, it appears at 2 to 3 months. Hamid, it appears at 1st year. Triquetrum, it appears at 3rd year. Lunate, it appears at 4th year. Now, trick to remember is, glow clockwise direction in the ulnar half. This is the ulnar bone. So, in the ulnar half, glow clockwise direction for the uh, appearance of ossification center. See, capitate, hamate, triquetrum and lunate. Now, trapezoid and scaphoid, it appears at 5th year, trapezium appears at 6th year, pisiform appears at 11th year. Pisiform is a sesamoid bone, which is the last to appear among carpals. So, trapezium, trapezoid and scaphoid, take it together, then trapezium and then pisiform. Glow anti-clockwise in radial half. Now, see these two x-rays, these both are x-rays of wrist joint. This is an x-ray of wrist joint, this is an x-ray of wrist joint. But do you see any difference in the carpal bones? See, the circle that I made, the oval that I made, you can see a small bone, bone behind the triquetrum. That is the pisiform bone. Now, pisiform bone, it appears at the age of 10 to 11th year. So, this x-ray is of less than 10 year. This x-ray is of 10 to 11th year or more than 11 year. Now, this is an uh, x-ray of an elbow joint. And in the, you can see this, this is medial epicondyle and this is epiphysis of radius. This is a thin line between both of these so they are not fused. This is another x-ray where there you can appreciate there is no thin line between both of them. So this x-ray is fused. Now medial epicondyle of humerus it appears at the age of 6 to 7th years and medial epicondyle fuses with humerus at 12 to 14th year. So this x-ray is uh, greater than 6 years but less than 12 years. This x-ray is greater than of 12 years of age, 12 to 14 years of age because it has fused. Now, few other points to remember for age estimation from 6 to 12 years. Center for lower end of ulna, it appears at 6th year. Ossification center for olecranon, it appears at 9th year. Trochlea of humerus, it appears at 9th to 11th year. Lateral epicondyle of humerus, it appears at 11th year.